Hi guys, watched a video by Jack and Jude a while back where she used a tilt switch to operate some circuitry. So I had a quick look on eBay, see if I could get some to play with. Ordered myself a pack of them, very cheap of course, all the way from China. I've stuck them on this very simple circuit. So we got two AA batteries, bit an on-off switch. Single LED, a 1K resistor, and two tilt switches. And the reason I've got two on there is I'm thinking of making something like my old friend the Rocking Snowman, only operating it using tilt switches. And I want it to be able to tilt one way and switch off, tilt the other way and switch off. And by using two tilt switches I can reduce the distance I need it to move. If I just have one or if I, if I put them up vertically they've actually got to tilt over quite a long way before they switch off. So it's on Yeah, so we're nearly 90 degrees on again, go the other way. Again, nearly 90 degrees, and that's much further than I want it to be actually moving before it switches itself off. Because so I'm just going to use it to operate an electromagnet and a neodymium magnet. So I'll have a neodymium magnet on the ground, electromagnet hanging down under here. And while it's standing upright, the coil or the electromagnet will be operated, so it should push away from the neodymium magnet. And as it tilts, it should switch itself off, allowing it to swing back again. But it's not going to be going all that far to go. I need it to go much quicker than that. So if I tilt these right down, so they're nearly at horizontal then it doesn't need to turn so far hope you can actually see that LED coming on and off I don't, didn't check for that yeah you can see that can't you so that's the idea it, it doesn't need to rock very far because it's not going to be pushed a long way away from the neodymium magnet. So I'm going to stick the power unit or the battery pack on the bottom. I've got this little um, bit of plastic. It comes off of a vanity mirror, I think you call it. Normally there's a circular mirror here that you can twist. But I'll just put a barbecue skewer through there or something attached to that, have a coil hanging out the bottom instead of the LED and a magnet on the, bot on the bottom of the, whatever we call this, bracket. So it should rock itself backwards and forwards. That's my breadboard, that's my battery pack and just got some double sided tape, foam tape in between to hold it onto the barbecue skewer. I've got this coil of wire that I wound onto a plastic bobbin for another project and a little bit of uh, that's a wooden coffee stirrer there. Nice big dollop of hot glue on there. I've got a nice long barbecue skewer sticking up vertically to give us leverage. I've taken the LED and the resistor off because we don't need them anymore. So switch it on. Might need to give it a bit of help, I think. Just these little. It's 
better. So there we go. Two rocker switches or whatever you want to call them, tilt switches. Need to get the adjustment exactly right. You can see that's gone out of adjustment already. So, thanks to Jack and Jude for the idea of using the tilt switches. <laughs>